I made it inside with all these snacks! Got all my favorites here, too! Can't wait to eat them! Wait… Look! Madison has snacks! Get her! And her delicious snacks! Ooh, she's brought the good chips this time! Hey! Give me some of those! Stop hogging! Thanks for the snacks, Madison! They were great! What just happened? They got all of them? It's not fair! They didn't even leave me a single crumb! What? What? They ruined my hair, too! This is the worst day ever! No snacks and a messy look! Wait… I am the snack and fashion wizard. Do not worry, Madison. I have a solution for your lack of snacks and messy look. This ring will bring you great joy in your hour of snacking need. This ring? I mean, I like it, but I don't get it. <sighs> I guess I have to do everything around here. This ring is made from a small container. Take off the lid. Now decorate the lid however you prefer. I like rhinestones. For this ring, I put the rhinestones all over the edge. I also like flowers, so this blue flower is the centerpiece. Now it's time for the next step. I took the bottom of the container and added a dollop of hot glue. Then I added the hoop for the ring. I made sure the colors match because I'm a fashion wizard. Time to fill the container with the micro snack of your choice. The container is full. Time to put on the ring. Now you're ready for fashion and snacks, Madison. The wizard gave me a snacking ring! I'm so lucky! Oh no! <laughs> Here, take it! Uh… Weirdo… It worked! She didn't know about the snacks inside! Speaking of snacks inside, time to open this ring! Look at all that delicious candy! Into my mouth you go! Delicious! Now I'm ready to face the rest of the day! Sometimes hunger can strike at the most inopportune times. Like history class. Oh no! Seriously? I can't believe you, Kevin! You got chips all over our desks! Here, use my wipes to clean this awful mess up. Jeez, it was only an accident. Hey, wait a sec. Wanna make your bag of chips explosion-proof? Take off the plastic dispenser and set the bag of wipes aside. Stick the plastic piece onto the middle of the chip bag, like so. Next, use a blade to cut the bag out of the inside of the dispenser. Nice! Now close that sucker up until you're ready to snack. Now, instead of spilling your crumbs everywhere, you can enjoy a bag of chips at your desk, mess-free. Aw, look at you sharing, Kevin. That's so nice. Sneaking a snack behind your teacher's back can be tricky business. What was that? Oh, nothing. I'm just taking in your brilliant lecture. Phew, that was a close one. You'd better be careful, Lily. You don't want to push your luck here. Hey, are you snacking, Missy? Huh? I told you snacking should be done at a recess, not in my class. Now fork it over, Lily. Oh man, that's all the candy I have! For this hack, take a stack of post-it notes like this one and draw a large square on the top of the stack. Now take a blade and cut a couple of sheets deep along the lines. Once you've taken out the middle pieces, keep going until you're about halfway down the stack. And last but not least, take your favorite candy pieces and stick them inside. And don't forget to cover it back up! Now when you have a hankering for a little sugar in class, keep cool and let your post-it notes save the day. Is there anything better than sharing a snack with a buddy? Well, if Kevin is your snacking buddy, you may not feel that way. Huh? How did we go through these so fast? Oh, that's how. Kevin's taking massive handfuls of the stuff. I think I may have a solution to this very annoying problem. Start with putting double-sided sticky tape on your favorite treats. Like this Mars bar. Once the tape is on, go ahead and stick it right onto your t-shirt. This way, you'll never have to get up to get another snack. It'll be right there for you to grab. And while you're at it, you may as well add all your favorite candies and snacks for super easy access. Alright, that ought to do it. Here comes the scariest part of the movie. What was that? Run for the hills. It's the almighty snack attack! What the? I gotta hide! I sure hope it doesn't see me. 
Little does Kevin know, it's just Lily, coming back to see how this thriller ends. Looks like you're in the clear, Kevin. Man, it's tight back here. Oh, phew, it was just Lily. Where'd you get all these awesome snacks? You even have a Mars bar? That's my favorite! Aw, that was awfully nice of you, Lily. And it's no problem, you have plenty more snacks to go around. Everyone knows going to the movies is all about the snacks. Too bad you have to buy them there. See, you can't bring any food from home into the theater. It's a harsh reality, but you've gotta follow the rules, right? Stupid rules. Ticket for one. Or rather, two, I guess. Aw, look at that little baby bump. Oh my goodness, I didn't realize you were with child. Please, go right on in. <sighs> that was easy. But little did that ticket clerk know, this child was nothing but a big ball of sugar. Yes! Mission movie snackage complete! Hey Kev, wanna turn that frown upside down with a little treat? Uh, yeah. Thanks, Lily. You're the best! And don't I know it. We're on hour two of this battle royale. No time for snacks. Focus! Quick, don't let go of that controller! Is that my phone? Gotta hit pause, sorry bro. Hey, what's up? These had better be here when I get back. What do you think I am, an animal? Good. And now, I wait. I can have one marshmallow, right? Come on, have some self-control. Oh, those pink ones are so sweet. You won't notice if one's gone. But everyone knows, you just can't eat one. Oh, uh, what a slippery slope you're on, Kevin. They're, they're gone. Oh no, I lost all control. Adam's gonna kill me. I know. I'll refill the bowl so he won't notice. Brilliant. What? You've got to be kidding me. Well, I'm a dead man. Stupid marshmallowy goodness. Wait a second. I'll just stick it in the microwave. Why didn't I think of this before? Whoa! Look at the size of that thing. It's a marshmallow on steroids. Who could say no to a thing like this? Adam's gonna go nuts when he sees these. All right, the moment of truth has arrived. Here he comes. Act normal. Whoa! Did these grow while I was gone? They smell the same. And they taste the same too. Oh, looks like you're off the hook, Kev. What do squirrels and humans have in common? They both love nuts. But unlike squirrels, opening them can be a challenge. Okay, stay there. Don't move. Everyone watch out! Ooh, my bad. Mm, let's give this another try. But this time, don't run off. Okay, Mr. Nut? No! Hey! What the? That really hurt. Who knew this little thing could inflict so much pain? What are you looking at me for? I have so much to teach you. And there's another way you can open that thing. And it won't leave a bruise on your face. Put the nut into this tool's hole. Give me that. You want to learn or not? Then aim. And... Fire! Boom! See? It stayed right where you want it. Smooth, huh? Just a couple of nutty guys. Pizza's hot. Pillows are fluffed. Now, what else am I missing? This party planning is serious business. Plastic plates? 
Could have sworn I bought some. This couch sure is lumpy today. There they are. Oh, now what am I supposed to do? I can just see it now. Everyone will grab a slice, and the toppings will go flying. Ick! They don't even realize they're holding food. Nope, this is not okay. I don't have time to run to the store. Unless I fashion some plates of my own. I do have a bunch of pizza boxes. Since you don't use the tops, you can cut into them any way you want. These squares can serve as plates. It's the perfect size. Here you go, David. Sausage and olives, my fave. And see, no mess. Am I the best party planner or what? <laughs> 